Marvin. Marvin. Marvin, third round of the FA Cup, third round proper. You've been there before, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, I was lucky enough to get a chance um, to play at Millwall against Everton, third round. Um, luckily got a goal as well and got a chance to go back to Goodison Park. Uh, so, yeah, I've been lucky enough to have that chance. <laughs> Now I have the opportunity to, to, to be in a third round again, which is fantastic. Yeah, well, so big grounds and big games don't phase you, do they? Uh, just you know, you've got to enjoy the occasion. Um, it's an opportunity for all the lads. Um, you know, we haven't really been in this, this situation too many times to play in such a front of big crowds and fantastic stadiums. So, yeah, it's what you play for, don't you, these sort of games. And, um, yeah, we're going to go out and enjoy it. I hope we'll enjoy it too, watching. Yeah, I think it's going to be a fantastic spectacle. We're not turning up to just make the numbers up. Um, we will be going there. Uh, to try and get something out of it um, and not just make a day of it but obviously we'll enjoy the occasion but also try and uh, go through to the next round Well Jake um, third round of the FA Cup a great game yeah. a good game and a great game at Grimsby to get here wasn't it? Yeah the, um, <laughs> it's the best game I played in and got some good memories of that game now So, um, but hopefully we can make a new one tomorrow and without wishing to give away any secrets, you played a definite role at Grimsby. Um, is there a chance that you might have a different role tomorrow? Well, the team hasn't been named yet, so who knows what's going to happen. Training today, um, no clues have been given away, so just wait and see. Hopefully be playing. I've been asked all the week by various press outlets, you know, what's the injuries, what are the suspensions, um, you know, what are the tactics, and of course I've said just what you've said, you don't say those things, do you? No, <laughs> Look, all our tactics, um, do you know what I mean, we, we kept to ourselves at the end of the day, everybody knows we're going to go out there playing to win, if anybody thinks we're going to just go out and enjoy the day, then they're wrong at the end of the day, we don't know what the team is, but one thing we do know is that we're going to set up to win. Very often a team that goes out to enjoy it, itself actually plays very well, doesn't it? Yeah, that's true. But at the end of the day, like, we will go to express ourselves, but there will be that mindset and we will have a certain definite tactic to go out there to do what we can do to try and go and get a result up there. Whether it's bring them back here or not, we still want to be in the draw tomorrow on, on Sunday to see if we can get an even bigger t team and an even bigger incentive to, to win a replay. According to one of our media outlets, my one of my favourite ones, BBC Wiltshire, um, we're expecting about 2,000 to travel tomorrow. That's fantastic, isn't it? Yeah, that is fantastic. It's good to see everybody getting behind the team. Do you know what I mean? Um, they always do when we're up here. So hopefully, do you know what I mean? They can make a big noise up at Bramwell Lane. And I personally would like to see you score at least two goals and uh, perhaps you can keep away from the penalty spot for a change. <laughs> I would like to see myself score at least two goals <laughs> for everybody's sake. So, yeah, hopefully it'd be a nice place to get some goal on, get some goals. Do um, you know I mean keep reaching my targets? And do you know I mean for New Year, nice place to start is Bramall Lane. Absolutely. Thanks very much, Jake. Cheers, Best of luck tomorrow. Cheers.